Hey, what's up, what's up, guys? It's your boy Sky Cobras again, and today, 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 I will be giving you my review of the first two episodes of The Rings of Power. I plan to do this weekly for every episode because just I want to pump out more Lord Rings of Power content because I really love the Lord of the Rings. If you haven't watched my previous video, which is me talking about how much I love Lord of the Rings and my thoughts um, regarding the recent controversies, etc., etc., check out the video like right here, right here. But anyway, let's just begin, all right? Um, just to pull up, just to start off, let me tell you of the things I did like, all right? Number one, I love, oh my god, the set design, the locations, my goodness, bro, everywhere we went, I was just in awe, I was like, I felt like a kid again seeing all these beautiful um, locations. Another thing that I love are the characters, oh my god, every character is solid. You have different characters to, to, to choose from, there are so many characters to follow and to like. You have elves, you have humans, you have dwarves, you have hobbits or harifats, you got harifats, you know. Another thing that I like is the pacing. I thought the show was paced so well, man. Like, it's 60 minutes per episode, 68, 64 minutes per episode, but it felt like 30 minutes each because I was having so much fun. It was paced so well, it didn't feel like an hour each episode. The soundtrack, whoo-wee, from the beautiful hymns of the elves, the dwarves, and their, their ominous hum, 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 where it sounds like a, a, a God of War soundtrack. The soundtrack is just beautiful so far, right? It's beautiful. And last but not the least, my favorite thing, about this first two episodes these first two episodes is the world building because i really get the sense of how big middle earth is from the get-go just from the first two episodes i feel the vastness of middle earth all the way from valinor up to middle earth you get lands from you get lands from the dwarves you get lands from the humans you get lands from the elves it's so beautiful seeing those different cities from the elves and dwarves, etc., etc., and just discovering them because you haven't seen them in the fir in the the movies or the in the movies of the Lord of the Rings or the Hobbit. So now for them to be put into a visual medium, it's just a sight to see. It's like wow, look at this spectacle. It really does feel like an Amazon-funded project. So far, so good. Maybe the only critique is i have is that maybe some characters are progressing slower than i what i what i would like it feels like their story is going slower than the rest but in the end really i give the episode an aragorn out of an aragorn which is short for a four out of five i wouldn't give it a five out of five which is a samwise out of a samwise so yeah pretty pretty good um but yeah that's been my spoiler free review of the rings of power episodes one and two i think it was very very well done beautiful set pieces a good variety of characters to follow so many of them so many of them to follow which just makes it even more interesting the pacing is great soundtrack is amazing and of course the world building ah oh my god it's just so beautiful and i'm just it just feels so happy to be back in middle earth again but it's been your boy sky cobras i'll be doing this weekly that's been my episode review of episodes one and two and i'll see you guys again for the next video all right wait bye bye now Aragon. bye